with you in the group with show facts and trivia. Appreciate you being here. Uh, you know what's coming up next. Please subscribe. Please share with your friends on Facebook. What's going on with you guys viewing? Well, you guys are cool, but the rest of them, I don't know what's going on. I was getting two, three thousand views, and now I'm down to like two, three hundred. Somebody's, I don't know, we need to get people back in here. Tell them that the uh, password to get into, get through the uh, golden door of good fellowship is Geronimo. Anyway, today, if you watched my one on George Lindsay, um, a few videos back, going to space, Goober going to space, then you might know some of this. You won't know all of it because it shocked me. I did not know. George Lindsay saved a life, unknowingly saved a life. Um, now, when you think of Goober, um, to actually George Lindsay, you think of Goober Powell, you know, the ditzy guy, but Goober would take us, would give you the shirt off his back. That's just kind of guy he was. Uh, matter of fact, that's how most of them in Mayberry were. George Lindsay, apparently, uh, I'm getting to like him more and more all the time, the more I learn about him. Uh, now, um, you know that if you watched the last one, him and Ernest Borgnine had a good friendship. Had would be like best BBFs or whatever, or BFFs, however the kids say that, best friends forever. Um, in case you don't know, Ernest Borgnine, he's best known for McHale's Navy and air wolf um and uh he won an oscar for his role in the 1955 film marty which also went on to win a best picture oscar um younger generations may know him as the voice of the mermaid man on spongebob squarepants uh what you may not know is he was a close friend with george lindsay um they met by chance when a mutual friend invited Lindsay to join them for lunch. Um, Lindsay was a big fan of Borgnine and jumped at the opportunity to meet him. A trio met for lunch and got to talking, and eventually the mutual friend had to leave for work, leaving Lindsay and Borgnine behind. Lindsay asked what Borgnine was doing that after this, you know, that afternoon, and uh, Borgnine said that he had to see his mechanic, so Lindsay managed to convince him to play around to golf with him instead which turned into dinner, which turned into hours of talking. The two parted as good friends and stayed in contact for years after. It wasn't until years later in 1992 when Borgnine did an interview with A Current Affair that George Lindsay learned he had saved his friend's life that day. Um, Borgnine had been considering suicide that morning, but Lindsay talk, uh, talking him into the game of golf had changed his plans. Uh, he had been thinking about killing himself, but instead he went and played golf with me, Lindsay wrote in his memoir. He said that I was responsible for saving his life. I never knew until he re revealed it on a current affair. Ward 9 went on to live to the age of 95. Just goes to show the little things. Uh, the little things you do for your friends, you don't know how big they can be. And George Lindsay just seems to me more and more like a really, really good guy. So, that's all I got for you today. Um, I would suggest if you haven't seen uh, Goober Goes to Space in about two or three videos ago, go back and look at it. It's pretty interesting. Anyway, appreciate you being here. Have a great, great day. Remember the little things. Be kind. You're a Mayberryan, you know. Uh, have a great day. Please subscribe. Please share these out. Uh, don't forget the trivia question on the web, on the Facebook page. And uh, catch you tomorrow. God bless. Mm -hmm.